I guess we don't need any introduction for Susie. Oh. What we've done is that uh, oh, we're going to, uh, we have the crew of the real lady. We're interested in you. You know, t today I'm feeling pretty sore, uh, probably a little bit sore than yesterday. My tongue's swollen, but at the same time I'm just so happy that it's over and we've had really nice response from Australia and uh, America, so it's, it's great. It's been fantastic. Welcome to America. Which is, uh, we had a strong current behind us and also the wind, and we were very fortunate. Whereas last time, getting into US waters, it was 39 hours, so it's a major difference, and that's what it's like in the Gulf Stream. You can have just unbelievable fast uh, currents, and we were very lucky, even though it was choppy and I've swallowed a lot of salt, but it, it was just a great swim, and it's great that it's over now. I think pretty much when I get home. What I did was my best, so you can't do more than that. I guess I'm still on such a high, and being in that cage for so long, you feel like you, you're trapped and uh, you're so lonely. So whenever I get around my family and you know, Justine and Mick and my brother Michael, I can't stop talking and they're like, go away Susie, you know, <laughs> we're sick of you. I love America so much, but at the same time, uh, writing yourself into the world record book, your courage and dedication is an inspiration to all Australians. Yeah, good on you, Kate. Kate Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? She's run three times.